What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit up my sponsor, SafeNBAMT.com. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout and stop getting scammed by NBA 2K's pack odds. Hit them up right now. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K21 My Team Video. And guys, today we're going over the auction as per usual. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to sub it up, comment down below. And uh, yeah, we are going over the market, man. Um, I opened up some packs yesterday. As you guys know, man, the pack odds just continue to suck and they continue to get me so upset. But um, yes, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to sub it up, comment down below. If you guys sub it up, comment down below, we'll do a nice giveaway. Let's hit 50 likes in this video. We're going over the market in debt. <clears throat> and uh, yeah, pretty much. We got a lot of stuff to go over. Like a lot of stuff to go over. So we're going to go over it. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. Hopefully you guys, hopefully this helps you out a lot. Because this video should help you out a lot in the MT investing game. Um, right now I have no MT. I spent every stitch of MT on packs. I literally have no MT at all. So, um, yeah, we're going to go over the market. Now, one person I will say that in, that went up about 30,000 MT is this Mello right here. I, I would have bought him yesterday, but I had no MT. Um, he was at 68K. He's now up to 97K. If you think I'm lying, I think... I don't, I don't have a clip of it, but I was looking at it last night. Um, <clears throat> he was so cheap. You could have bought three at 68 or... One for 68, one for 72, and one for 77. Now he's up to 97,000 MT. So if you listened to me on Friday, which was yesterday, you did make a lot of MT off this car, Schmello Anthony. Very, very expensive card right now. One of the cards I predicted a go up in value just because look at his stats. He could shoot, he could dunk, and he has amazing defense. And I think he has Hall, and he has Hall of Fame clamps, and he has Hall of Fame range. So uh, yeah, this, this card right here is literally one of the best cards in the game, and I don't understand why I didn't buy more of him, because, I mean, this card is just phenomenal. Let's see, where's the D3s at? This card, you just have to pay attention to this card's price. It goes up, it goes down a lot. Next card. Next card we're going over, <clears throat> if you invest it or not, is Mr. Zion Williamson. All right, looking at his price, he was around 29.30 yesterday. He's at 46. He was at 35, 33, 38. He's at 42K right now. So 42K for Zion. If you got him for 32K, you're going to make 6K plus. Um, pretty good stuff, man. This Zion Williamson definitely is a very key card to invest in. He goes up, he goes down like every other player. This guy is amazing. I love Zion. He's a hype card. Definitely, definitely want to pay attention to him. Another card that went up in value because I actually sold one of these dudes for around 12K yesterday. And uh, I think his value <clears throat> is up over maybe 20k, just because he is actually very good. Oh wait, wait a second. I did sell one for 12k yesterday when the packs first came out. All right, he's starting to drop, which makes sense because he is a diamond. But all right, so if you got him for 12k, he was maybe even cheaper than 12k because there are so many on the market. There still is. He was a very common pull in my opinion because I pulled two of him in 120 box. This is definitely one of the cards that is going to be cheap. You just got to pay attention to his price. You could probably get him for 12K all day, sell him for 15K. Not a bad player to look at. It's a pretty easy way to make MT, man. Just consistently look at this card. Um, so he's at 15K. That's weird. There's a lot there for 15K. I guess that kid bought a ton because they're all around the same timeline. Uh, but next up, <clears throat> Pink Diamond Cheapest, man. The Pink Diamonds are really, really dropping low. They're dropping to like diamond range of last year. Um, so I noticed Walter Davis, Desmond Mason, all those pink diamonds are starting to rise a little bit. This Desmond Mason was at 8K, he's out at 10,300. So if you picked up 10 at 80K, you now have 100, you now have an extra 1K per card, which means you have, oh, oh, that's a beautiful snipe. Jason Richardson for 10K, big fan of this card. Pretty, pretty decent card, I guess you could say. He is kind of outdated, but yeah, it's already gone. That was a snipe. That was a good buy, whoever got that. I think that card might be 15K plus. Um, like I said, the, the pink diamond filter <clears throat> is definitely something you want to pay attention to. And guys, I feel a lot better. I feel a lot better today. Thank God I have COVID. But uh, yeah, I feel a lot better. Thank the Lord. Um, but these filters right, I'm showing you right now, definitely interesting. Amethyst filter. I have 1K MT, so I can't buy anything. Um, it sucks. But let's check out the Ami filter. Look at this, guys. If you invest in Amis like I told you to, that Dwight Howard, that Brent Barry, look at this, guys. Look how much they're up. They're up over 1,700 MT. They're at 1,200 MT. So Brent Barry's at 1,750. You get them for 1,200, you sell them for 17. You make around, what, 1,715. You make 300 MT plus. That's pretty solid to me. 
um so you're making around 300 mt plus if you sell for 17 a week later so that's pretty fire um that's pretty much 25 percent chance uh double your profit which is pretty interesting uh 25 times more not 20 2.5 times more your profit which is pretty fire um the amethyst filter in general this week was just absolutely amazing all the amethysts are up in value a lot another card i want to pay attention to is zach levine he's a very common pull but people like him including myself he's in my starting lineup right now okay a very good card let's check his stats there are so many snipes in this card he actually went up in value and um <coughs> let's check it so he's around 5k this card's gonna be posted up for 4k and less all the time there's gonna be so many snipes in this guy right here um so you just want to pay attention to this a lot of the amethyst players that don't have a lot of reduction loss from the 10 percent fee zach levine is most definitely one of them so you kind of want to i guess you could put your price to this look for 4k and or under and you're gonna make some mt i'd say his price goes up to maybe over i don't know how many days left this 13 days left in the seasons i say this card goes up to around oh wow i wish i had mt see what i'm saying that's a free 700 mt that one's gone already yeah so that was a free 700 mt that filter is very active anybody in packs you want to pay attention to Let's check out the Gazoo filter. Yesterday there was 12 cards in the Opal filter and some guy bought out all 12 cards. And now the Opal filter is getting ruined again, but I bet you in a couple refreshes, the Opal filter will be brought back. Is another good filter that I highly recommend, man. Um, the Opal filter is always good. You cannot go wrong. And obviously the Dark Matter. Are you going to get a snipe on the Dark Matter filter? Honestly, most definitely 100% not. I'm surprised they made D-Rose a Dark Matter too, because honestly, I don't want D-Rose my point guard. I'm rocking with Pink Diamond Ben Simmons right now. I think that's one of the best point guards in the game, even though he can't shoot. You run Giannis and Ben Simmons together, it's almost impossible to stop down low. Two very, very fast, quick big men. Very impossible to stop, um, in my opinion. And I'm running uh, Dwayne Wade at shooting guard. Very interesting stuff, in my opinion. I love it. I'm running Giannis Pink Diamond uh, Retro at center. So that's my squad right now. It's pretty cool. Dwayne Wade at shooting guard. Zach Levine, Abby at small forward. And Blake Griffin, Pink Diamond at power forward. Um yeah so that's pretty much all we got for the video i just want to go over some things the market if you have any questions man let me know down below hope you guys enjoy i still do sound sick but uh I'll, i should get over it i feel a lot better today so hope you guys enjoyed have a good one peace